On a see today, eh? today, today, now we go judge as the matter go be. Right here and today, guys, we are going to settle this matter because this matter, if you don't the theory, I don't the the rift of what should be and what should be not about these three popular Nollywood producers and movie directors. So, I want to say that today, today, now I want to settle the matter finally. And after now, I don't want to hear Pim about this matter again. Now, guys, the matter right on ground is that there has been so, so, so many back and forth about who the best producer is between Ruth Kadiri, Uche Mbunambo, and right up here, the mama, the mama of Nollywood, Funke Akindele. Guys, so today, we're going to iron it out. We're going to straighten it out and we're going to pick it and sift it out and know who should win the best. Just let me right here in this video because right now let us know the drag who did they stand for and whether I'm a judge to carry the vote or whether I'm saying no, no me judge to carry the vote or whether I'm the best person go win or we go no to they just the carry your body and your mind cool but before I proceed guys don't forget to like this video share this video and drop your opinion in that comment section let me know what you think about this video in the comment section now before you proceed please guys don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel please subscribe to our youtube channel and also make sure that you put on your notification bell so that you can get more updates from us whenever i post a new video on our channel thank you for subscribing guys god bless you and bless the work of your hand now the, the article right up here is saying you see these three movie producers right here give them their flowers any aspiring actor who wants to grow and make money in the movie industry should follow who no road and people win no road na Ruth Kadiri for Kiakidele and Uche Nambunambo and others. But I recommend these three first. We have seen the numbers of young stars these people make every day. And their movie I always talk about when we released. Hey hey. Should we talk about a tribe called Judah and blah blah blah? But guys, let's go straight into the comment section because and I'm gonna say this video is still long. So I promise you if you watch it again, you're going to find out who actually won it for everyone. This one said, Root always seems like the same storyline every time. I love her, but I don't fancy her movies. Same storyline, same face, same soundtrack. Uche Mbunambo, best movie producer boy, is also unfortunately that AMBCA doesn't want to give him the flower he deserves. Funke sometimes the hype and good PR, they push a movie. Lesson is not always in a storyline, but they are all good in their own ways. This person was talking from a constructive criticism side. Another fan said, especially Funke Akindele, I single-handedly give that woman five stars. Mm, but come right on point. Another fan said, I love Ruth Kaderi movies. I can't wait to be accepted by her in the industry. She a Ruth Kaderi movie you like because you won't enter industry through her. Madam, talk through with your mind. Another fan said, I will run fast and play a movie with my twin Ruth all the way from Namibia. I watch all of you movies. I love African movie or oh, oh, Nollywood to the fucking world. Another fan came out and said that. Keep on my dear darlings, you're the best. Who did you stand? We don't know. Another fan said, Ruth Kaldi become my best among them. Oh, sorry to say, I love her and her movie with passion in eh? him hmm. like say Ruth Kadir they carry with him she they carry first and she they lead at the moment because hey hey guys this is not even funny hmm. this conversation when I was under it in on that Facebook I was just like hey they are not going to that on top say they stand movie producers like this and fan said I love them they are all doing great in the movie industry hey, yeah madam love it love it a fan said, Sir Uchena, all the way. Hey, hey. That is to say that they are talking based on the point of view of Treasure in the Sky, the movie that went viral and had over 10 million views in just four days. Another fan said, Ruth Kadiri, all the way, my biggest, and shout out to her. Hey, hey. Normally, normally, Ruth Kadiri, they pull weight on top YouTube movies. Another fan said, Very creative beings, keep it up. If I said they are all superheroes, I wish one of them would just pick me up one day. Yeah, this one don't know where she won't belong. Another fan said, every producer is good, okay? You're just posting this three because their movies eat up. Of course, if every producer is good, why can't the rest of the producers make their movies eat up? Whose fault is that? I won't forget. Everyone is good in one way or the other, but there are surely people that are best in all categories. Another fan said, 
So how I go take follow them when no road? I beg if you know the road, carry me follow. Chine and Nebella was any of them na shop log. I love them all, okay? If I said you keep bad mouthing people's effort, it's no easy now. If I produce yours, na negativity go full am uh -uh. Make all these netizens where they always come online with frustration. They try keep body down. I beg try to calm down. On this internet space, we are here to catch crews and inshallah. Another fan said, best movie producer so far. Please include Uchenasi. You know, I don't have ad feelings. I could have included Uchenasi, but right now, right up here, I don't think for the league of these three, Uchenasi is not nearing it a bit. We're not talking about Asabawuji, we're talking about Nollywood in general. Another fan said, I never knew Uchenambo is a man. Oh, huh? It's a man now, a man to the call at that, eh? Man with the pull string. Just go and check out his YouTube channel, Uche Mbunambo TV, and you should ask that man the pull weight, forget them. If I said Uche Mbunambo movie, no get to compare, like it does not have comparison. It doesn't spend much on movie like Funke, but his storyline and movie can't be compared. I don't miss his movie. I get notification anytime I see new movie from him. To me, he's the best producer, I beg, and he selected his actor. Also, where yeah, like guys, this person has a point, you understand. Which I will know how to cut costs in movies and still deliver what will make viewers talk. And I said, Uchi Umbunawo is the best for me. His movies are always so touching and reflects life without any form of artificiality. He is the best. Others to hear Uchi don't the win now. Oga Uchi Umbunawo don't the win. And I said, finally, I can put a face to the name. Uche Mbunambo, this guy is too much. All the three of them are wonderful. Okay, I love Uche Mbunambo. Never watch any of his film and regret. So now you say you don't watch Umuskade film, make you regret, or you don't watch Fukakendele film, make you regret. Look at the day care for I don't like Amu. For this matter, na Fukakendele me I understand. Another fan said, I finally see this man Uche Mbunambo. I love his movies, but why people not knowing him? Like why don't people know that Uche Mbunambo is a man? What were you thinking before, guys? He really makes nice and realistic movie. Uh -huh. Whenever I'm looking for a movie on YouTube to calm myself, I just go on YouTube and watch one. Much love, sir. Oh, oh. Much love, Uchena Mbunambo. And I said, especially Uchena Mbunambo, he makes really nice and realistic movie. Emphasis on realistic movie. So I think for me, Fukakendele make blockbusters. Another fan said, I am giving the flowers to Fuki Akendele and Bruce Kadri. And there's something I love especially about Funke. She loves lifting actors and actresses to recognition. Hmm. If I said, hashtag Uche Yuna Mbunambo, you too much. I love all your films. Bruce Kadri, na boss, you be. Fuki Akendele, I come out cap for him. So na equal balance. Anyway, belle face, na in she be. If I said, Fuki okay, Akendele movie are top notch and always have a lot of light, life, and inspiration to it. I so much love her movies. Another fan said, For me, I love Uchena Umbunambo, Uchenansi, and then Root. But Akendele, I don't have a chance to watch his movies. He's always on cinema or prime video. Me, I love it. Ah, hmm. I even say people say don't expose. Obviously, Shazan Uchena Umbunambo. People that Shazan Uchena Umbunambo, I was his name. People are basically talking from the point of view of always watching from TV. Like you always stream from TV, you don't go to cinemas. No shades and no offense intended. And that said, in Hollywood, though, it is either Ruth Kadri Productions or Funke Akinili's Productions or Uche Mbunambo Productions or nothing. Indeed, they deserve some flowers. Another thing I love about them is how they raise stars. God bless you all and big art for you. Mm -hmm. If I said, I finally see the face behind Uche Umbunambu. I love your movie, sir. You're really doing great. Funke and Root, a common cap for now. Mm. Very, very saucy, suspicious. Very suspicious something. So, guys, this matter, no one get part two. Like, you know, you won't get ending at this junction. Okay? And like I said, for real, I give it to Uche Umbunambu because he's a legend for real. Nice and interesting movies from his end. And Bruce Kadiri is good in raising new and upcoming actors and actresses, but Uche Na tops them all. And Tifunka is also good, but what she does too, kudos to them all. Sometimes I wonder if Uche Umbunambu is from this country because his movies are epic and very, very educative, motivational and outstanding. I'll pick him over everyone here, though I like Ruth too. 
because she's trying to okay so guys it's not up to you viewers of this video let me know what you think who does it better for you between uchena mbunambo ruskadiri and funke akenele because for me in that Hollywood, they are the bosses of bosses sorry yeah they are the bosses of bosses the lead and other follows for me my honest opinion is that Uchina Mbunabo is trying for people that watch YouTube, but if you are the type that watch movie in cinema, my dear, forget. Mm -mm. Ta, ta baffled, yeah. Forget her. Forget her. They try. She has this way of making blockbuster movie. And even if you go and check the highest grossing movie in Nigeria right now, top three, she's seated prettily on the top three. Talk about a recent movie that went viral and had over 1.4 billion naira gross income in less than a in less than two months sorry pardon me yeah the tribe of judah another one was a more ghetto the saga and the one battle on the booker street so guys i don't know who does it for you let me know who does it for you in this video and before you go please don't forget to like this video share this video and also drop your opinion in the comment section also please and please if you're here for the first time hit that subscribe button and drop your opinion Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and also make sure that you put on your notification bell so that you can get more updates from us whenever I post a new video on our channel like this. Thank you for subscribing, guys. So, see you again next time with more exciting news. Keep watching, guys. Love you and bye bye for now.